I like the way he shows that uh, the deviation. This is something that you I almost always see on everybody who comes in uh, originally. They're going to deviate to one side because they don't have that core stability. This is the reason I like this is because he shows it how most people actually do the exercise, which is wrong. He's going to show us how to correct it here. And I see this a lot in my office. The compensation that I see on this first rep, we'll go ahead and do it again for me now. There's a lot of extension, lumbar compensation right here. So first off, somebody with lower back pain that's going to increase their lower back pain. Okay, so now he's at 90, kind of like a tabletop. Here, he has a lot of flexion in his, in his upper back. It's what we call kyphotic. I want him to open up his chest the other way. Sometimes you'll see people use uh, like a bar or something like that, so straight now, across the way. Everything's like posture, like you could be standing. Okay, I want to. That muscle's here. Okay. Now, he's going to extend the hip with the knee bend without bending in the lower back. Go ahead and do that. Hold that. See, it's all glute now. Two. Glute and abdominal Three. work, and the lumbar spine's taken out of the equation. Okay. You can look at the back right there, but now we know the back's not moving. You see that? Mm -hmm. And then now we know that the, the work's coming from the glute. And the, he's st stabilizing from the, abdom the abdomen. And the, the bar would roll off if he's giving any type of deviation. So, see so that bar is like placed in the middle of the back. Specifically, yeah. That way, that way you, you don't get that deviation. If, he, if he's right. doing it wrong, the bar will fall off. So the bar just keeps him, um, the bar keeps them honest.